the Winnipeg Gold Eyes kicked off their 25th season on Friday night. Rick Forney is now in his 13th year as manager and his 22nd overall as part of an organization that has delivered 21 winning seasons and 19 playoff appearances since their inaugural campaign in 1994. Forney's career in professional baseball started back in 1991 as a pitcher in the Baltimore Orioles farm system, and the Maryland native still enjoys the excitement of opening night, sure, I get excited. Forney said, I like to play meaningful baseball, and Game 1 is just as meaningful as any game you're going to play throughout the course of the season. For me, if you take care of your business, Game 1 is going to be more important than Game 100. If you take care of your business through the first 80 games, then you can make Game 100 irrelevant, hopefully guys are ready to go. Forney continued. They all seemed excited today as I saw them moving around through breakfast at the hotel. Everyone was out in the lobby early getting on the bus. You can tell they're excited to hear, the Gold Eyes have the opportunity to become the first club in American Association history to win three consecutive championships. As it stands, only the Fort Worth Cats back-to-back -back titles in 2006 and 2007 rival the Gold Eyes' accomplishment from the past two seasons. However, as tantalizing as it is to dream of a three-peat, the veteran skipper stressed the importance of hitting the proverbial reset button and not looking past the game at hand, whatever happened in the past is in the past. Forney said, Can't pick up where you left off. Every year is a new battle and a new puzzle that we need to put together. The teams that can put it together the quickest and learn the fastest are the ones that are generally going to have a good season. I think we have all the makings of a good baseball team, the ultimate goal is always to reach the playoffs and give yourself an opportunity to compete for a championship. We've been really fortunate to accomplish that the last two seasons, but that's a ways down the road. We have to make sure we respect the process and do what we are supposed to be doing on a daily basis. Up until this point we have, so now let's see what we've got. The American Association restructured into a two-division format over the winter, and the Gold Eyes will compete in the north along with Fargo Moorhead, Gary South Shore, Street. Paul, Sioux Falls, and the expansion Chicago Dogs. The best two teams from each division will qualify for the postseason. The league will also operate with an equitable schedule in 2018. Each club will play its divisional opponents four times, twice home and twice away, while facing everyone in the opposite division twice, once home and once away, Railroaders 3, G-O-L-D-E-N-E-Y-E-S 2, W-I-N-N-I-N-G pitcher, Cox, 1-0, losing pitcher, Boschers, 0-1, the game, the Winnipeg Gold Eyes fell 3-2 to the Cleburne Railroaders in their 2018 season opener at the depot at Cleburne Station on Friday night, Railroaders left fielder Axel Johnson doubled home catcher Michael Pear with a double in the bottom of the ninth inning to win the game. The Gold Eyes took a 1-0 lead in the seventh on a two-out RBI double from Anderson. Cleburne responded by scoring two unearned runs in the bottom of the frame. Johnson tied the game with a ground out while Alex Polston's double to left made it 2-1. Winnipeg retied the game in the next half inning on a long home run to left by Reynaldo Rodriguez. Gold Eye starter Charles Rosario took a tough luck no decision, striking out nine batters over six shutout innings. <laughs>